artists have I met. Yeah, Papa San, nice, I've met nice. Brent Jones. Okay. Um, yeah, quite quite a number. Nice. Wow. Mm -hmm. All right. Wow. This DJ, oof, this is um, DJ Fresh over here, guys. So um, this is big time over here. Thank you, Ima. Thank you. <laughs> so, <laughs> all right, cool. So, um, what what is your take on gospel artists? Not not just not just holy hip hop artists, but gospel mm -hmm. artists as a whole. Mm -hmm. uh, what's your take on them? Do you feel that um, that they are uh, expanding? Do you feel that they are doing more, doing less? What do you think? Um, I would say they're expanding because mm -hmm. um, it depends on who it is. I mean, right. I, I don't think we can generalize and say, well, if we were to generalize, I would say we're expanding, but mm -hmm. you know, um, it depends on who it is. Um, okay. there, are, there are artists out there who are really doing it big. Um, there are some who have crossed over like Kirk Franklin, Mary Mary, mm -hmm. you know, so, um, which is a good thing actually because you know you, you get to reach to reach out to you know a lot of people who would traditionally not go to church or right. who are always in the clubs mm -hmm. in the cre uh, in the in the secular clubs that mm -hmm. is um, yeah but uh, I would think we are um, we advancing okay. um, there's a lot of college music that is being put out there nice um, there are a lot of artists that have come up. Mm -hmm. um, I think there would be, there will be more. Mm -hmm. um, yeah, and some are using a lot of, uh, a lot of resources within their reach, like you know the internet, to to reach out to more people. Right, right, right. And um, yeah, I would just encourage them, you know, keep doing your thing. Okay. Uh, keep putting out music. Mm -hmm. You never know, someone might, uh, you know, might might hear that uh, that one song, and you know, like. Um, I read I read the story of Mary Mary and uh, how Shackles came to be. It was not even supposed to be the lead single. And really? You know, yeah, it, it it was just a song that they just did, and you know, so I mean, it caught on, and you know, everyone wanted to sing Shackles in the nice. clubs, and you know, you never know okay. that that one song that you might think would not do anything mm -hmm. might be the one sh song that would uh, you know throw you up. Right, right, right. To national you know a national stage makes sense makes sense of course that is mm -hmm. true that is true mm -hmm. so let's see um so what would you like to see happen in like the next five years in within gospel music mm, what would i like to see i'd like to see more christian hip-hop mm -hmm. coming up i would like to see uh more uh, mainstream media, um, you know, embracing gospel music, mm -hmm. what, be it, you know, gospel or, you know, hip hop, R&B, reggae, you know, I'd like to see more reggae. Nice, nice. <laughs> more reggae. Is, that would be I nice, mean, yeah. Uh, yeah, because, you know, um, I feel, I feel secular reggae has way overtaken. Oh, yeah. Um, gospel reggae and, you know, it's, it's, as uh, if we were to, to, to give a, you know, sort of a, um, a peek as to where, you know, if Christian hip hop was here, mm -hmm. then, you know, secular reggae, I mean, secular hip hop is here, then secular reggae is here. But in terms of the Christian circles, you know, Christian hip hop is here and mm -hmm. reggae is down here. Right, know? right, right. So I would, I would tend to, you know, to, to see more of Christian reggae coming up. Mm -hmm. um, in terms of, uh, you know, videos christian music videos mm -hmm. coming out because you know in this era of youtube and all you know all everyone right. is going to the internet oh everyone yeah. is you know watching music videos and if you know christian artists are not going to put out their music videos to you know to fuel their their music right i mean um we're going to be left behind mm -hmm. yeah so i tend to think um yeah that's that's what i would like to see in the next five years all right all yeah. right and what about you? Uh, what do you plan to accomplish yourself in about five years? Five years? Um, hmm. Five years. Um, I s still want to, to develop the gospel jam mm -hmm. to, to hit up uh, more states. Mm -hmm. And uh, more also 
not just to be to be here in those states, but also DJs in those states to be having their own gospel jams. Mm -hmm. um, I would like to see. I, I mean, I would like to get back onto radio and doing the mix shows and, nice. and stuff. Actually, mm -hmm. that's one of the goals that I have for this year. Um, yeah, and uh, basically just uh, help uh, in terms of Christian music and Christian uh, entertainment. Okay, mm -hmm. okay, nice, nice. All right, cool. Mm -hmm. All right, so if uh, anybody wanted to like, ever like hit you up or anything, mm -hmm. how can they contact you? Uh, they can contact me using... Uh, uh, my website, mm -hmm. djfresh.org, okay. that's djfresh.org. Mm -hmm. um, you can also hit, hit me up on email. Uh, my email is djfresh at djfresh.org. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so um, I'm also on Facebook, on nice. MySpace. Okay. So, you know, but you can, all, you can always get all that information from the website. Okay, cool, mm -hmm. cool. Well... I want to thank you for coming by. Hey, thanks for having me. Oh, yeah, it's all good. I guess so you got to come by anytime you want. All right. Come over here and DJ some more and everything. Mm -hmm. If you want, you can um, bring Wah with you, too. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, that was my boy, man. Yeah, for real. Yeah. He, he's cool, man, cool. Mm -hmm. All right, so, again, people, you're watching The Green Room. We just had DJ Fresh over here doing his thing and talking to us and everything else, uh, sharing his knowledge, knowledge and everything. So... I'm your host, Alvin Lewis Jr. I'm uh, in the back seat, chilling, watching the show. <laughs> Hi, Ima. How you doing? Okay. Good. I did it last time. What? Okay. Ima! Okay. All right. Bye. Yeah, that was a shout out to Ima. So um, yes, and again, she's in the back seat. So we're going to take a look at this other video. Uh, say, I'll keep it locked and we'll be right back. Green Room, Alvin Lewis Jr.